guys, it's your girl here, Art Diva. Today, this is going to be a talk through, flip through. Let's play on words, y'all, but talk through, flip through. And uh, this book is new to me. It may not be new to you. Uh, this is by Jasmine Beckett Griffith. And this is um, a collection of her paintings. She's an acrylic artist painting, painter. And um, this is uh, her first book, A Fantasy Art Adventure. And then along, uh, which you will probably see in another video, because this book is quite thick. There are 55 images in this book. So I'm just going to show you all what I chose from her collection. I need to go back and double check to see if there were any other color books that she has uh, made that I like. But so far, these are the three that I like. And I got... Uh, these books here from Amazon most of my books come from Amazon and if they don't I, I always put in the description bar where I get them from I don't always have a link for you sorry but at least I have the title for you and where you can pick it up at okay um, I'm gonna move on to the next one and the next one in her collection is a spine tingling fantasy art adventure and this is her Halloween collection and and the last one um, that I chose is her mermaids okay so let's go ahead and you'll have to catch these other two on another video otherwise this video will be quite long so let's get started and uh, I just read the jacket really quick you know I just skim through it uh, she's an artist and she deals with acrylic paint and uh, her projects uh, have been published in books and galleries and she's even done some work for Disney. She lives, oh, I'm sorry if I didn't have that up. She lives in uh, Celebration, Florida. Let me pan it back so you guys can get the full gist of what's going on. Uh, this is a jacket cover on the book. Some good card stock. And then I'll show you the back. And this is the back. Here are some of her images. Okay, and that's the price that was on there, but I didn't pay that for that. But a pretty close. Okay, pretty close. Books ain't cheap, but they was worth every dime. Every dime. It's pretty reasonable, considering I paid much, much more money for books from Korea. So I didn't have a problem with this. And um, let's just flip right back in again. This Blue Angel Publishing. I don't really get into all the publishing companies. But this paper, let, let me start by telling you how the book is. This is a glue-bound book. And uh, the paper is uh, like a off-white, uh, off-creamy white, I should say. I should say light creamy, whatever color. But the paper, I can't even tell you the percentage on this paper or what degree it is. But all I know... Uh, I've done some good books and like I said most of those books with their really great paper quality come from Korea I'm just saying but um this book I'm so happy and fortunate that it's here okay uh, where I can use my talent of uh, coloring but everybody has their own talent so don't really read what I say into that but let's flip right on through because I don't want this to be a super long video Here's our introduction letter to you. She tells you all about it. All the rights and copy in the publishing company on this side. And as I stated before, all the images in this book and the other books are from her collection of paintings that she has done. So yeah. And on each page, it has a little summary of what's going on. And I think it's going by the year two. I think when she did the painting, and it's, this one is called The World, and it, I won't take, read, take the time to read all what's in here. It just tells you about the image here. But look at that. Oh my God, are you guys seeing this? Do I need to come closer? Look at that. Look at that. I'm mean, when I tell you the paper, oh, I can tell the high quality paper and my Prismacolor pencils are what I use if you're new to my channel. Hello for all my new people. Thank you for coming on. And hello to my day ones, of course. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy all the flip throughs. I normally don't do a whole lot of talking through the flip through because a lot of times, like, I want to see what's through the coloring book and I don't necessarily need to hear you, 
just you know talk or whatever so i think it's for me for my channel it's just better that way and i can just flip through it because you know sometimes when you talk you go on and on like right now i'm into five minutes i've only looked at one picture you see what i'm saying but anyway this paper is so freaking nice it's not perforated so you cannot tear anything out but why would you like i'm not gonna tear anything out of this book good thing i have on my phone an app that um and if you want to know the app you can message me later because i don't know if it's going to be copyright infringement or something for saying in this video and i'm not trying to do that but yeah if you want to know the app that i use on my phone to get free uh pictures uh you only pay like a little a little fee for your shipping and you get so many free pictures but what i i just recently started doing is after i color a picture one that i really like i'll take a picture of it with my phone send it to that app and you could print it whatever size you want to print it in okay i think it even go up to 20 by 30 or something like that you print whatever size picture you want and so yeah i'm not gonna tear my images out that way i can just display my own art like here i got in my room got all this marilyn monroe stuff i'm gonna move most of Marilyn to another room and just surround myself with all my colorings so here's another look at that look at this diva right here she is too cute. Now, I'm not a real big animal lover, but, you know, I've had, had a dog in the past, whatever, it's okay. But, honey, that's like another kid. And my husband and I, we empty netters, nesters now. And my daughter's gone. I only have one daughter, praise the Lord. But, <laughs> yeah, because my nerves can't take more than one. But, yeah, so, you know, this is what I do with my free time. This is my outlet, okay? This is my thing to do. If only I could draw this well. I told my husband the other day I would be an illustrator and make coloring books and make a fortune. But I can't draw this well, but Lord knows I can color it, honey. I can color it. You make it, I can color it. But look at this. So if anybody out there wants to send some free coloring books, what? <laughs> For all business inquiries. But, you know, hey, most of the time I just get all my books out of pocket, so. Yeah, look at her. She's the, the steampunk clockwork dragon, dragon lean. Look at that. And normally, uh, I would stay away from books like this because I think I saw this book like maybe, not this particular book, but it might have been this book or style of book like this where you got the oversized, exaggerated head and the eyes. I was like, yeah, I don't know if I want to call it that, you know, but a uh, teacher song. But, you know, I, I, kind of, I tend to stay to fashion and you know home material i've got a bunch of color books with that and fashion home material you know portrait styles i like doing faces so since i like doing a whole lot of faces and stuff I like doing the makeup and making them look good and everything so i was just like you know one night just looking to see if they had any new color books on amazon that i might want to get put on my wish list whatever and go back here later but i came across this and i was like i gotta have this i said oh my god i've been sleeping on these books the whole time and little did i know that the paper was going to be this great quality like now you see me just feeling on it it's just so soft my hands just gliding on it so you know how those um uh, prisma color pencils will work those are very pigmented pencils they're artist quality and that is all i use now they aren't cheap those are run you to a uh, well over the hundreds i've been lucky to just get it at 100 and 115 yes i have uh I have a spare and I have a spare for my spare. <laughs> yes. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna get some more silver that I am. I'm not even done using the first set of pencils I have because I'm like, okay, I'll freak out if I don't think I have enough pencils all the time because I literally color every day. Like every day. So um I'm lucky enough to where I'm I'm a homemaker, I don't have to go out. But you know, there are things that I do, you know, I still gotta make sure to take care of men, take care of home. So, you know, but whatever free time I got, I have a book in my easel in my lap, and that's what your girl do. So, we're going to move on. Look at that. <laughs> to me, I just get a kick out of it. It's, I'll be laughing through this whole video, y'all. I'm sorry, but she is so cute. I'm going to play those eyes up, hunty. And normally what I do, like if you ever see me do a flip through and you see a sticky post in it, I'll try not to do it with the sticky post in it because I don't want to obstruct the picture. But I call it tagging. Now I, I'll like, sometimes I'll like pretty much the entire book. There's other times that 
there may be two or three pictures that I'm like, I'm not even wasting my time or coloring it. I'll cut them out. I would cut them out, but I would use an exacto knife so you don't see all the tear in my coloring book because I like it to be nice and clean. You would never know the picture was what's missing, but not in this book. I love this whole entire book. I kind of scanned through it a little bit before I got on camera, and uh, yeah, let me just keep flipping here. Because normally when I do these coloring book flip throughs, honey, my husband is asleep or he is out of the house. And right now he's running the errands, so I need to hurry up and <laughs> flip through this book before he come and be making all kind of noise on my video. Okay. Look at that. Perched and sat and nothing more. Even the title is sassy. Little, little wings on her. And they're all single-sided, as you can see. The only thing that's, if you want to say it's double-sided, is just the feature of what the picture is. Uh, but that's it. The, all, the, all the drawings are on one side. And the paper is pretty thick. Yeah, it's thick enough. It's not too thick, not too thin. But you can tell they, the publishing, publishing company, really took their time and put this on great paper not to create space paper like a lot of my books are that I get from Amazon but yeah I always no matter what even if it's something is as nice as this I always put a piece of cardstock in between each picture because I use gel pens as well okay and I don't I well I won't take that back I was gonna say I don't use any particular brand I have those sometimes I'll do but I just go back and order the same ones that's not like a real high quality but I do have some that are high quality and those gel pens are uh, like they run you like $30 so yeah they're uh, cedar markers it says cedar markers but they, they they make gel pens too so and they used to didn't have the refills and now they make the refills so you don't have to buy a whole new set of pens but yeah I, I use cedar marker gel pens and I use my prisma color and so here I'll probably like use both on my my more thinner uh, pictures of paper I, I use more of the pencil but I miss using my gel pens more so I'll get to use my gel pens a little more in this collection of uh, from uh, Jasmine uh, Beckett Griff look she's cute Look at this diva right here. Pretty pirate Polly. <laughs> and I like all, it's just the detail is so nice. I didn't think I would like to be here, girls. <laughs> I think I like them, they're actually cute. That's pretty butterflies. I like that. Sun child and moon child. Are y'all holding a bottle of potion or some perfume or something? Look at the work. Look at the artwork. You can do your clouds and you got the sun beaming out from the cloud. Oh, just me all of her drawings have a little sass to them I like it and I'm like I said before I'm not a big animal fan but if they're like you know in the picture and it looks a little really nice with yeah I'll do it I don't mind it I'm not the one that like to call a whole bunch of flowers and mandalas and no no mandalas no 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 I said mandala mandalas no I'm not that type of girl I, I don't no, I don't even buy that type of boots at all. I like to color drama. I like to know what's going on, okay? I need drama. This is drama. I don't want to color a whole page of flowers. I just don't. Not to knock anyone else if that's what your thing is, honey. Do you. Because I'm going to do me. This is what I like. Not just with this book. That's pretty much any book I got. Okay. I got so many books, y'all. I promise you I got like one, two. I think I got about four or five kids like big bags like not just a regular bag I like a luggage bag full of coloring books I've got books I haven't even started to color in okay like this because see this a book like this to come and it'll trump everything else that I've said I want to try to color like no 
and then I've been the ones that I really don't like. I liked them at the time when I wore them, but I don't really care about it because I got something that just upgraded everything else. I would, um, you know, give it uh, to. Uh, sometimes I sell it. You know, sometimes I just want to just bless my friend with the girl I used to work with at the law firm. Yeah, Y'all used to work at the law firm. But anyway, um, for those of you who don't know me, but uh, yeah, I used to work at a law firm, and so my friend and I wish their friends, even though. Uh, we both left the company years later, but anyway, um, I was, I got her into doing adult coloring. She loves it, and so, you know, I give books to her. Either I say, hey, I got like 20 books over here. You want to come look through and buy some for me? And I don't charge her what I pay for these books. I may charge her 3 or $6 a book. Like, girl, she's like, yeah, I'll come on. I'm going to get some books. She bought some books from me not long ago. I need to get some books together for her now because I've been buying these new books. And so, yeah, that's how that goes. Look at her, she's cute. It's a Wicked Witch and Glenda. <laughs> it's like a play on the Wizard of Oz. I love it. Now the other two books that I have, I I may not talk through it. Uh, I may just flip through it, but I wanted to at least go ahead and talk through this one and introduce you to what I'm into now as far as books. And uh, if you've been with me for a minute and you've seen me flipping through books, you, you'll pretty much know the type of quality books that I like. I like to get quality books and so if I don't have a quality book, trust and believe, I do send it back to Amazon. Like, no way. I don't want to waste my time coloring that. Because the reason why I started doing more a lot of these flip-throughs is um, even uh, online. Uh, I think I was looking at it. I think you can actually see in this book on Amazon. And if not this one, you can see through one of the books that I just showed you. So that's how I was able to kind of see what was going I don't think I saw all of the pictures, but yeah. I think somebody might have uploaded some images or something, or I know one of them it may have a flip through on there, but that's rare. Um, that's the only thing I don't like about Amazon and their books. Um, I mean, I'll take them out. I love Amazon because it's where I get my books from, but I don't like it how they do the coloring books. You can't see an image, and then once you get it home, you're like, oh, no, I want my money back. I don't want. I don't like to. I don't like to color or take my time and color cartoonish looking pictures. I guess that's why I was staying away from these type of books. But once I kind of got a glimpse and saw how how pretty it was, I'm like, okay, that's not so bad. I don't like caricatures and all that type of stuff. But this is a nice book. See, I don't mind coloring the tiger, the elephant that's pretty, and she got her hummingbirds, and butterfly, and it looks like the top head of a peacock. This looks like a doe. Hey, Bambi. <laughs> and then you got your alligator, honey. She in the wild kingdom. Where is she here? She's the goddess of the animals. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, no, they didn't play a own words with the Lord. They said Eve and Rib. Skeleton Rib. What? Somebody had to read that. I know it says something to do with the story. But it, it was probably a, a some kind of fairy or something before and that's the skeleton part of it, I guess. Who knows? I didn't read the whole thing. I just kind of skimmed through it. It says the painting is called Eve and Rib, a clockwork fairy and her animated skeleton boyfriend. Okay, see. A clock or uh, his boyfriend in the forest. Alright, so her, her loved one is gone. And she I guess she did just check him out. See, is his ball still around? <laughs> I don't know, but okay. Alrighty. And that's the end, y'all guys. 
you guys I should say look at that and you can kind of see how you know some of the that's what I do a lot of times I look I look at the shadowing colors they use and how they might have done and just put my own spin on my thing so okay guys I'm getting off here now this has totally been 20 minutes and if you stuck around for the whole 20 minutes you a true soldier and I love you so okay that's why I like doing a whole bunch of talk throughs but this book was rather long it has look how thick it is and it's nice even the outside jacket is nice the book is nice and thick and firm and it's pretty and if you can afford those high price prism color pencils like I got you don't have to try to get what I get you know what I have just get what you can get they have some cheaper brands out there you can get I mean hey I started off using them too and then uh, I, I upgraded so hey just make your own wonderful world of coming and I'll see you guys later bye